It's a Rita figure. Let's take a look. All right, who can name this episode, or at least tell me what's happening here? How about this episode, and the set does include Zed's green crystal. We'll do one more, who can name this episode, or tell me what's happening here? What if Zed was actually creating the Psycho Rangers? True or false, Rita Repulsa once summoned the Tiger Sword. My Hasbro Pulse 2 putty set came while I was making this video. I was working on like a lightning collection so far video, but I've still got stuff coming. So I'm gonna keep this one short and just wait till a few more things show up and then do, you know, everything that's out so far. So stay tuned for that. Maybe I will squeeze in the putties while I'm here. If you already have the Green Ranger and Putty 2 pack from GameStop, then you already have this putty. The black stripes on the chest are the only way these putties are different. They do come with new blast effects, though. This one not only can be used on the putty, you can also put it on the ranger as well. I like that. And it also comes with one of these effects, which I'll give to Chase. Yeah, for like a sword kind of thing. I did paint my original Lord Zed, which makes doing a comparison a little bit more difficult, but the original didn't have the silver paint on the hands, so that is present on the new one, and then if you look at the staff, it's almost exactly the same, but look at the bottom. It's flipped. So, I, I think it's correct now. Off the top of my head. <laughs> one of these is wrong, obviously. It fits. When I turned on my computer this morning, I had one of those Facebook memories. So I guess today is the anniversary of when me and Chris went to Target and found that incredibly lifelike figure of Andros. This was August of 2016 just after Paramorphicon. All right, I'm gonna go see if they have any toys. 10 bucks says they don't. <laughs> so empty, I walked by it. I've seen worse. Still no Titano charge. I've never seen it in person yet. I have Puzzler. I think you need another one. I have this one. I've never seen yellow in stores. Nothing. All right, so how does my target selection compare to the Philippines? Oh, aren't we in the Philippines? Is this Philippines Target? I didn't even pay attention to where we were going. We both have nothing. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to fit you. Oh, I feel like we've had this it'll discussion. He <laughs> could fit his arm inside. Yeah. Oh, Maybe his leg. Oh, honey. That's wonderful. <laughs> yeah, it's Hall, a yeah, yeah, Chris doesn't look back, right? He can't. Like, if you look yeah. back, then it, it spoils the explosion. Yeah. August 17th is also the anniversary of when I uploaded my Morphicon footage to this channel.
Well, hopefully there could be a Morphicon next year. How many of you guys are going if there is? Hey, you guys remember the set that Mia and I made before the wedding two-pack was announced? Well, here is the crystal that we made. And then here's Hasbro's. They're actually very similar. That's pretty funny. Theirs is translucent. Ours is a solid 3D print, uh, which I painted. But yeah, pretty similar. It's not too late to order Zed and Rita. Put a direct link in the video description. All of the lightning figures are always in our kit. Direct link in the video description. If you missed the Season 1 Goldar, I wish they had changed the head, but Season 1 Goldar, uh, Zeo Ranger 5, Mighty Morphin Black, In Space Yellow, Psycho Ranger set, you know, anything that you guys may have missed. White Ranger's not in the US yet, but that does take you to a UK listing. Direct links are always, always, always in the video description. Definitely check them out. Still waiting for this set to come into stock. And I can also put a direct link to the non-transforming Zeo Megazord 12-inch figure. The paint app on her mouth on mine is a little bit messed up. Like, instead of the lips being on the lips, they kind of go <laughs> across the teeth. And then the lip is missing the lip, if that makes sense. Uh, but I, I am so thrilled to finally have a Rita. And this is a really good Rita. I mean, if they do another one, which they probably will, with, like a, with gold markings on the dress, I don't know. I hope they'll include the space dumpster. And I hope they'll do a different head with, like, maybe more of an evil smile expression. Uh, that would be my hope for a future Rita, but this is a fantastic Rita figure. It's got a cloth dress. Really good job on this overall. So I am so happy to finally have a good Rita figure. Uh, she has not been very lucky in terms of figures. Like uh, the five inch figure, well, five and a half inch from back back in the day never happened, only the prototype. Then we got the Samurai Rita. Well, not Samurai. It was, she was really storing Samurai. You guys remember that one. That was not a good Rita figure. And then there was a much better Rita coming at the end of Bandai, at the end of their days, and then that got canceled because of the transfer to Hasbro. And then I was like so worried with this one that like something was gonna happen like with the release, but here it is. I did figure out how to play My Heart Will Go On in the X-Files tune, so that's on the vlog channel. Hope you guys will check out our vlogs. Direct link the video description. I could put a card up here if you wanna click there on the screen. Gonna end here though. Thank you guys for watching. We'll be back with more good stuff. Hope you'll subscribe and good night. It's rocking. And you guys know what time it is. It is more time!